there's a darkness at the center of all things. It'll change you if you think about it too much, but it's always there. It waits for you. When I was in hiding, I tried to forget everything that I was. Now I aim to keep my promise to a dead man, someone who meant the world to me. Sometimes I still hear Dowd's voice echoing through the metal of this miserable knife. This is the strangest, most important thing I've been through, and that's saying a lot. There's a mining complex on Shindere Peak, somehow so obscure that most people don't believe it exists. That mad cult lives there, protecting the one place that can bring me face to face with the outsider himself. Years ago, I heard Dowd talking about the void, a fear that grips your throat, bends your spine, but I can't turn away now. What will we have left if the outsider's gone? His name might be lost to the void, but tonight, I'll find out if he can still bleed. It'll be interesting. North Quarry Terminal Station. Was it's I just, just place. sleeping on a cot? It shouldn't exist, but from what I can see, this place is real. What was that? At least for now. Here, the void is closest to the surface of reality, breaking through and spilling out all the fear and power the Abbey of the Everyman tries to hide. We have uncovered that already most. What you do now will change the world. You again. You know I used to wonder if you'd speak to me. I almost wanted it. Every street kid, every desperate wretch pushed to the edge. They all wanted you to speak to them. Why didn't you? Why me, now? You know I'm here to end this. You and this disgusting cult. People have come to this place for centuries wanting many things. To elude death, to seek forbidden knowledge. They are never satisfied no matter how much they take. Not even the dead find peace here. You will find another relic of the cult's heart. A piece of whatever God came before my time. You will find the people who murdered me. When I knew them, they had names and ambitions. Now, they wander this place, their minds snared up with terrible secrets, keeping hidden the unspeakable ritual that made me what I am. Deep in the void, they put a knife to my throat and tore my name away. You have found the knife. Maybe you can find my name in the black viscera of this place. If you care to look. Why are you telling me this? What do you want? We both know how a mob can justify a murder to themselves. Who I was or what I wanted never mattered to the cultists here. I will not speak to you again. The next time we meet, you will be face to face with what was done to me all those years ago. Your mind echoes with everything that Dowd wants you to do. But I am here to say that you have a choice, Billy Lurk. Hmm? Kill the outsider or find another way. I mean, in this playthrough, I'll kill him? But I'm actually very curious. Reach the mines. Okay, well. What is this? Game, you stupid. Okay. Where is everyone? Oh. I hate this place already. <laughs> well, look. Can I not? There we go. Oh, freaking game. Are you serious? What the hell? Why can't I go on that thing? Oh, 
snow. I can go on up on top here. Wait, is it actually useful? It's not useful, is it? <laughs> oh, maybe it is useful. Don't move. I said don't move. Thank you. Ooh, a place I can go down here. What's the... Why? Well, there's food there, I guess, but... Is... Why? Sister Rush at Chindari Peak? Silver Fever? Oh, Silver Rush, not Sister Rush. Silver Rush swept to the Karnaka this week as would be prospectors hoist a shovel and left to strike rich on Chindari Peak. A recent discovery of thick vein of silver ore at the North Quarry has brought unprecedented profits to mining companies and small claim holders alike. Reports say the lightest stroke of the pick uncovers silver nuggets worth thousands. The wild rush to make a fortune means that claims on the shil on the peak are going fast, but there are still opportunities to work miners. Well. Okay, so that's okay then. All the food. Can I get in here? Oh. Okay. Okay, well, let's. What is. Is there anything in here? <laughs> There's nothing in here that's useful. I guess you can come in here and sneak this way. Uh, so, my question then becomes how the crap do you get in there? Can I go through that? No, I can't go through that. What is that? What is that thing? Ah, it makes my eye burn. Oh. I m well, I missed that, okay. Hmm. Oops, not what I wanted to do. One mark. So what would be... Okay. Oh! Is there something I can put under it? Oh wait, no, that doesn't make any sense, because I can't... How... Is there... Yeah, you don't have... Semblance, Displace, Foresight. I wonder if... No, not here about charms. This one will be better. Um, where's the... 
Tactical, no, not tactical. Okay. I wonder if that one's gonna be better. Because I can just do. Right, that way. Or is there another way to do this that I'm missing? That's another possibility. Hmm. Not enjoying. Oh, kick ass! How about that? Alright, that's how you do it. Um, well, I don't know if that's how you're supposed to do it, but that's how I did it. Yeah, so I'm not gonna grab this one anymore. What was the what did I have before? Is that a nerfing target? Yeah. What is this? Blade ballet. Is this really how you're supposed to get in here? Oh, okay. Alright, well I guess we can Keep going, man. Oh, and then this is how you're supposed to get out. Okay, I get it. I get it. I get it. What the hell is this dog? Well, whatever. Let's just not worry about the puppy. Not perfect, but whatever. Wait, can I eat? That's gonna. I thought that was gonna hurt. I guess not. Are you gonna? Oh, you're not gonna give me any more. You're not gonna give me my uh, my things back. No, okay, that's fine. I guess. So what happens in here? Bone charm. Exacting aim. What's exacting aim? Your Voltaic Shots deal slightly more damage, which I don't really mind. Spring Rays have a slight chance of eliminating a body. Oh, okay, that's what that was. Let's just keep going, and then... Yeah, I, unfortunately, I... Well, unfortunately. I ended up buying everything that I could, which is fine. Oh, difficulties continue. Concerning reports have disrupted mining activity at Shindiri North Quarry. Again, with many working on-site... Complaining of unsettling visual and auditory hallucinations. These have ranged from seemingly innocuous instances of misplaced equipment to large sections of the more disappearing and reappearing within hours. And the large section of the mind disappearing and reappearing, okay. The widespread nature of these collective hallucinations have made them difficult for the Shindiri Mining Company to dismiss. For the more rumors of black damp? Miners' slang for a lack of breathable air caused by underground gases have spread, leading to several threats of generic strike across the company's workforce, as well as a growing labor shortage, as many miners choose to leave the troubled site. Accusations of poor working conditions, particularly lack of adequate ventilation, are entirely unfounded and ultimately harmful to our operations, said Bernice Castiglia, a representative of the Shindiri Mining Corporation. When reached for comment, we are committed to the health and safety of our workers, and have taken steps to ensure these reports, these reporting, those reporting headaches, memory loss, and hallucinations have access to proper counseling and treatment. I don't know how much I believe any of that from anybody in this game. Okay. So it doesn't look like there's anything useful in this little building here now. How about... Yeah, this probably looks just like it's a place I can sneak around, but ultimately not super helpful. Okay, that's fine. Um, yeah, let's go this way then. Okay, fine. What do you use? Oh, that's kind of weird. It was...
Ooh, is there something up there? I would assume that would have popped up. Just based on how these games work. Oh, it's in here. Oh no, it's probably above us. Could we? Oh, we could have just come here instead. Well, this is all fine. What is it? Swift Stalker? Oh, I guess it's probably if you're crouching you move faster. Which is not a bad thing, to be honest. And, oh, this is it. We can't keep... Alright, so we... See, again, this game's forcing you... Something I'm not a big fan of. I feel like I'm hearing a crow and I don't know if it's within the game or if it's outside. The mundane things cast aside distraction. I'm gonna say it's in game. Where's the heart? I was just feeding the rats and talking to them. Like the lonely rat boy from the story. Hmm. <laughs> not in the story. The void needs you. I don't want to go to the void anymore. I've seen what happens. The stone grips more than your body. It takes over your mind and heart. This is our purpose, Anto. This is why we're here. Don't fight the influence of the endless and empty. I don't want to. I'm scared. I don't want to become like them. <sighs> don't worry, you. Why do they look like that? What goes on here? Oh god. Ooh, whirlwinds? Okay, we'll go this way, I guess. Like, they shot their own people. That's just kind of weird. Okay, that's definitely the game. Anyway. Now, oh, Chad, am I crazy? Do you hear birds? Okay, you know, instead of doing this, maybe I should just do this for now. Oh, there's nothing in here. Okay. I don't know what that turns, so I'm gonna not turn it yet. Huh. Uh, yeah, no, we've read that already. I said I can eat this whiskey tumbler. No. No. No, 
nothing in here, and nothing in here. Is it? It's above me, isn't it? Yeah, it's right there. Wait, is it that? Or, oh, no, it's right there. It's below me. Okay, I guess I can't go there. So then... No, not what I want. Oh, I can't do any... Can I go... Ugh, can I do anything? No, I can't do anything. Alright, fine. Let me not do anything then. Oh, that means I can't go here, probably. No, I can go there. Huh? Okay. Supervisor's note! The front gate code is 203, or 207. I can't stay here a minute longer for a while. It was just little flashes of light, like cracks in a window pane. But now I hear voices, and it's not just a few whispers. Whole conversations, like they're right beside me. Sometimes I see strange people out of the corner of my eye, but then they're gone. It's like everything shivers and changes in front of me. And then it's back to normal, like nothing happens. This place is cursed, I don't know what's going on, but I'm not waiting for it to get worse. I'm gonna go back, to, I'm going back to Karnaka. Okay, so. How, how are you supposed to get? See, this is kind of weird to me. How are you supposed to get in this office to begin with? I'm assuming it's there, but there's no other way to get in here. And also, this can't be the only reason to come up here. Is it? If that's the only reason to come up here, I don't know if I like this area. Like, it's not even... Is it, oh, there's, what is this? Okay, there's some stuff here. But not a lot. That's kind of interesting. What about over... What about over there? I don't know. Wonder how far back it's gonna... I'm gonna be. Okay. Oh yeah, that's right. You had that coming and you know it. How will you find wisdom when- What? I didn't like that. I'm going to have to hurt out. No luck. Ah, no! Let's search that's, over there. That's then. horrifying! Why did I walk like that? What goes on here? See, how- I want to see how they saw me. Like, legit. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else that was needed for me, right? There to where? I don't know. Alright, well. Yeah, not gonna grab that. feel for my studies yes i stared into its core and recognized myself it yearns as i yearn under its gaze i sank beneath the surface of these waters i walked the path of the envisioned and witnessed the churning of the void in the flesh oh. mm, okay 
lady up there. Two people up there. Okay, well, that's kind of weird. The dead see with such death. The eye of a dead god sees all our desires. Can I? I can't throw those. Oh well. That's gonna not. Well, that didn't work. It's fine, although I kind of... My, I super missed my grenade, but I didn't think they would be walking away that much. Well, I kind of want to use my gadgets. Well, kind of use my gadgets. Um, can I... No, I can't. There you go. Oh, really? Not a... Not a big fan of that. But okay. I had some stuff to eat. And then there's another apple here next to the tumbler. And then I think that's it. And I don't think there's anything in here that was helpful, if I remember. No, okay. No. Read that. Code 207. I guess the 207 is is what's uh, is the important part. Right, I'm gonna go this way so that I don't kill myself again. Oh, so I guess that that, <coughs> that crank opens up the door again. Like one of these two doors. Which I guess I could try because... Oh, no, what? Wait, what? Oh, I guess it's supposed to help you go there? Maybe? I'm a little confused. But okay. From you, I get a voltaic. Wow. Oh, tonight we commune with the eye. When you've finished your studies for the evening, leave the library and join us in the chamber. The relic will look inside us, and we must aid its search. The void lies inwards. We must bring it to the surface to see its truth. Bring three sharp knives. We have to cut people. And let's go check lady over there. Uh, bring three sharp knives. Okay, so can... Uh, yes, I can. Oh, this is not nearly as sinister as I thought it was going to be. I thought there was going to be more stuff in here. Because there was a crank, right? Here? I don't know what that does. No. That's what I... Okay, something like that. And... No. I'll take all of the incendiary bolts. I guess at this point I'm able to have eight incendiary... No, eleven. Okay, never mind. I thought it was a bit more than... I didn't know it was that much. Where am I going? I'm not gonna miss this time. How are you guys not dead? That's... Uh, yeah, I'm gonna just... Oh, 
I'll take that. I'm surprised my grenade didn't hit anything. New bone charm. What the hell, game? Screw you! When I'm angry at the game, but... Oh, I guess I did kill her. Maybe? I don't know. I guess I got one of them, at least. Uh, is there a bone charm anywhere near here? Is that what you're telling me? Oh, wow, okay, so this... Oh, okay, I'm full on bullets. Is there... Yeah, I was gonna say, what is over here? Oh, place to hide, that's what's... Alright, well, good thing I'm not hiding. Alright, let's let's check some is there am I did I miss anything? Oh, whalebone. Not that it matters in any way, shape, or form right now. Where is this? Oh, balls! Okay, this is not... You know what? I don't care. Good to know it's there? Where is this? Alright, oh, yeah, screw it. Good to know it's there, but I'm gonna not worry about it too much. Also, it's whalebone, so I'm not that to the to the eye. Up. Okay, yeah. Um, I don't think I need to go down. I mean, downstairs is probably helpful. Wait. Downstairs is probably helpful? Hmm. Here, I'm gonna not. What? Indeed. We are truly fortunate to experience the passage of Envision twice in one day. I read that Envision can't communicate with us anymore. Can they see us? Or can they only see what's in the void? In Witness by Stone, Nozaku posits that Envision can see us, but choose not to speak. They have locked your map. You don't just ah. You've seen too much! You rap back! What? You were supposed to You shouldn't have done it. I just like the I honestly like the combat in this game, so. I don't mind. uh uh. I thought I was going to get something back. Um, I don't mind. Well, I mean, it kind of annoyed that I threw it way too far, but that's my fault. To the eyes over there. Guardians of the ritual. All of you have appointed yourselves to a better existence. Lifting up from the muck and the dank warrens of the ignorant of society. You see the world for what it is, discontent with illusions. Only you see the truth. Let us remember why we are here and the importance of our work. Thousands of years ago, we took a wretch from the streets beaten and discarded and glowing upon the embers we found there. We set alight the fires of divinity at the very heart of the world. We created the outsider himself, fellow seekers. A face instead of the endless dark. Black eyes rather than that malevolent emptiness that came before. A voice speaking to select few, over which otherwise would be the howling of forever. Of nothing okay, this is not... without end. And now he sleeps in the ritual hole, 
held in the crushing grip of the void itself. And he will sleep forever, fellow Seekers. For that is our charge. Oh, okay, whatever. I don't really care what he says anymore. Anyway. He's just yapping and yapping. So can I... Oh, I can't go there. Ooh, what's over here? Is it hook mines? I have to use... I have to start using hook mines. This reminds me of Fallout for some reason. There's a mission in Fallout 4. Not like Fallout generally, just Fallout 4 specifically. Oh, am I going to be on top of this dude? Halt. Authorized personnel only. Alright. I'm authorized personnel. Malkyrodian and I used to have long discussions on ancient translation and linguistics. Oh, there's people there. It's a pity we... I'm gonna eventually get one. I wouldn't praise him too. What? Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Alright, come over here, buddy. You are tough. Oh, fuck my life. Did all of that kind of work? I got a carrot. Out of it. Ow! Motherfucker! You'll pay for that with your life. Need to make sure. Face your death! Do you fear death so much? <laughs> you Ow. For her death. What the Now, did this other dude like kill himself? I know. Okay. Did I actually do did I actually do that? That was not great, I got four left. Okay. Well, that was a fair amount of action, so not too bad. Reflex I wanna know what that other dude had. The dude that I couldn't hit. Where was was it? Yeah, what did you- Oh, you didn't have anything! Or did I pick it up already? I may have picked it up already. Yeah, what's actually kind of nice is I actually th Oh, well, you died somehow. I mean, I'm not- I'm not angry at all that you died. Entry forbidden! I need a key for that. Where's Macholdi? Is, is Macholdi in here? I need a banana. I'll take a banana. Oh wow, is that the eye? <laughs> That's so creepy. Hues of the Void. My Nongui? We lack the language to express the Void in all its complexities. We have no words for its beauty. There is... I think I, I think this is in... in, in, in Dishonored 2, I believe? There is a rich... I think. There is rich velvety darkness. I was hoping it would say dankness, but, you know. Of the depths of the ocean, the hollow hues of the sky, of the starless night, the cold color when you close the eyes to the moonlight, the mottled pigments of the brute, blah, 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 blah. I was ignorant. Yeah, okay, so you are not super helpful. Okay, so I need to find a key, evidently. Okay, so none of these things... No. Okay, so you don't have the key... I mean, I'm assuming I nobody has... Like, nobody I killed has the key because... I didn't... S what is that? Oh. oh, that's just a audio log. Forbidden. Could be worth looking into. Well, look, I need to find a key, okay? If you're gonna tell me where the key is, I'll take you there, but... Otherwise, you have to rely on me to find shit, and that's not a good idea. Oh, 
Okay, so let's just... Okay, so you don't have the key. You don't have the key. You don't have the key. And then looks like you don't have the key. Okay, nobody has the key. I will, however... Oh. Can I pick that up? I guess I already... I don't need that. Is the key in here? I will take... I will take all of those. Ooh. What is that? Armored bones? It's probably higher defense. I'm gonna not worry about it too much. Is there a key in here? Cultist Diary? Has begun when I woke this morning. My shoulder felt stiff and insensate. When I inspected it, there was a thread of pure silver stone running across my flesh at last. I am merging with the void. That's kind of weird. But to be removed from this reali reality and exist eternal in the next. To see the subtle shifts and patterns of the void. To be closed off from all contact with the lesser creatures. I'm eager to see its progress. I'm assuming this is about a month later. 12 hearths, 24 clans. The stone spreads. I felt it humming in my heart as it enclosed me. Is it I felt it humming with heat as it encloses my very heart. Sometimes I'm breathless with it. I can barely listen to the others. At times my tongue won't move for hours and I'm mute. Second of nets, which I guess is the next month after that. My left eye has been entirely subsumed by the void. I can see strange shifts in the light, but it's mostly endless darkness. I find it difficult to focus in my work. And then I guess a month later. My pen slips from my hand even as I try to write these words, my fingers have grown cold and numb to the to all sensation. Some have even fused together in amalgam of stone. I am exalted. That's kind of weird. You probably should see a doctor about that. Oh, I guess the, the, the I guess you get a. Oh, this no. Wait, what? I'm trying to figure out what's the point of this. I guess it's just for power. Yeah, but I need the I need the the, the, the key for that. Okay, what's up there? A memoir. Okay, you can read that. I'm not super interested in that. I've gone half mad with loneliness, roaming mine shafts deep into the mountains. I'm reading the last paragraph. When I stumbled upon a giant eye, it seemed to hum with power, beckoning me. And when I touched the eye, understanding exploded within me. It's an interesting way of saying it. Understanding exploded within me. The invisible layers of the universe were laid bare to me. I left the mines a wiser woman. Shindari's secrets... Shindari's secrets and mystery no more. I witnessed no more vanishings. Forever after the town remains stone solid for me. That is very weird. Alright, okay, let's go. Oh, wait, we can't go there. No. No. over there then. Oh, can I? No. Ooh, what's down there? Well, I guess not that much. Potatoes! Oh, I'll take that. I'll take all of that. What if this just goes all the way around back over there? Please. I don't know what happens when you throw this on a person. Let's see what happens. Let's let's, let's find a person and throw it on them. 
Like, I don't even know if something happens. Uh, no, this one, Chant of the Eye. The other one we've seen like, in every game, it seems like. Oh, they're not. Oh, crap. <laughs> Okay, let's let's do this then. You can just sit there. Ow. Ow. Yeah, that's super fair. Oh god. Lady. Ow, fuck off. Ha please die! Motherfuck, how are you not dead? Also, I missed you, but that's fine, I guess. I was trying to be... stylish, and I got caught in the corner there, and I almost killed myself. And now I have no... yeah, I have two more. If I can find the key. An evaluation of the prominent Eyeless of Karnaka? Jakubi. Further delay. He's a man of singular dedication. Any difficulty he encounters, he overcomes by sheer force of persistence. He's not only devoted to our intellectual ideals, a studious man, dis dispassionate, interesting, yet obsessive. How can you be dispassionate but obsessive? That's interesting. In his single-mindedness, he can be prone to nervousness, nervous fits and neglectful of himself and other duties. Furthermore, he's too enamored of the sanguine infusion and, his, and its effects on his mind. Yun, further delay and deceit. He appreciates the patterns and nuances of the void. His knowledge and passion would enrich our pursuits here. But the man is a celebrity. Oh, the, yeah, Shen Yun. Okay, Shen Yun. As of yet, he would not be suited to our rigors or lifestyle. Or our lifestyle, his public profile is too high to relocate without causing some alarm, and we believe he enjoys that fact. To ascend within three years, Michael's moment of consummate control. She has maintained a network of patrons and subordinates, which has allowed our influence to spread and our studies to continue. Her reliability and consistency is unquestionable. It is though her it is through her efforts and resources that the dangerous relic of the outsider's creation has been kept secure. Our trust was not misplaced. Okay, well. Okay, I will take all of those, please. Thank you. What is this one of stars? Is that a... Oh, yeah, I don't really care. You can read that if you want. I'm gonna not. I'm sure you finish, I'm gonna read it, just not now. Okay, so let's spread across our world the moment she returns from the void. I thought just this. Like, wait, who exploded? Maybe I'll take... Mother! Please! I was gonna say, please die. Alright, you're, you're definitely dead. Ow, 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 ow! What else can I... I can't really use it. Alright, let's just be simple. See, that's what they wanted to do last time, for the most part. And I'm happy I kind of ended up doing it this way, this time. Wait, you have a third eye. That's just weird. Um, is this... Oh, this probably goes up? Okay, let me... Let me... Stop it! Stop it! 
Yeah, so... You're fine. You're fine. You and your leg are fine. You're fine. You're fine. You're fine. Okay. I'm assuming this goes out to the other... Why are you there? That's just weird. Yeah, this goes out... Oh, no, wait. Where is this? Ah! This is... Yeah, okay, so this is kind of where... This? Oh, this goes nowhere! Alright, so... Screw that. This is just a... Uh, if you're not being a moron like me, and you want to do stealthy. Essential Eternal? Uh, I th think that's been read before? But I may not be 100% sure. Was it Moldoge? Oh yeah, I don't want to go there just yet. I want to see if I can find Moldoge's key or whatever. Whatever that person's name was. At least he died peacefully. Right, chat? That's the important part. Okay. <laughs> I like how a pen becomes a voltage shot. Yes, is that four? Yeah, okay. Well. Uh, yeah, I, yeah, this I just read. These are... see in these encounters is avoid interesting but no oh wait what library inventory and upkeep our referencing system needs to be reviewed as soon as possible bibliographical inconsistencies have been noted in several recent works which makes study and citation difficult some of the older texts have been gnawed by rats and need to be rebound make sure there's no mold in the pages before removing the damaged binding the mines can be damp in unexpected places. Also, put down more poison. The first lot is clearly not working. Uh, have the latest accounts of sanguine infusion been sent to us? It is needed for our research. Repeated use. These infusions seem to have a dele deleterious mental effect alongside prolonged contact with the void. It is of great interest. We must compare long and short term consequences. Um, one of the eyeless. In Karnaka, smuggled a letter along with the shipment of text and provisions. It was examined and burned. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Okay, well. Alright, so that seems to be fine. However. I would still like to find that dude's key. Um. All right, what do you guys have to say? Thank you. That was kind of oddly poetic for... Yeah, I just... Oh, this is part two? Ah, right, you can read it if you want. I'm gonna skip that for now. Nope. All of 
this is interesting, however, is it interesting? No, it's a head girl. Okay, what do you guys do over... You guys do nothing over here. Yeah, I can't. Okay, so I think the only place to go is to the eye now. Nothing, this is just to just to hide. Yeah, so Okay, so is there... Okay, so there's no... This, this... Unless you're gonna glitch through, through stuff, there's no way this is gonna get you into that room. be back in a minute. I don't think I can get to it yet. Alright, let's keep going. Um, bloop. Yeah, let's go. I didn't go farther, okay? Really, I can't carry any more of that type. How do I... what? Oh. Can you... yeah, you can see properly, okay. Locate... I That's it. The eye of the dead god. It No. It's been a part of me since this all started. It's cold. Dead. But it still sees. What? Oh, am I in the... Wait. Am I in the void? Yeah, I was gonna say, am I in the void? I can see... everything. The void. Like looking under the waves and into the sea. You probably didn't... What are you... What am I looting? Oh, you're... Malkyoti. Okay. I tried to find it, but then I realized it had to do with the eye, so I kind of stopped. That's why I kept going, because I, I realized there's nothing to, nothing left for me to do, and the key came after where I was, so. 
What do I do? I do for, no. What I do, I do for the sake of my studies. The risks are great, but it was never in my nature to leave questions unanswered. Everything must be revealed in time. The others may judge me, but that same desire exists in their own hearts. They are simply too cowardly to pursue it. The only means to the ritual hold lies in pieces, suspended at the moment in time in which that ancient gate was shattered. It will break the oldest and most sacred dictates of our order by simply approaching it and attempting to trespass. I do not know if I will succeed, but I must try. Whatever happens to the to my body, I know that my research is hidden in safe place in my cell. My life has led to this moment. My wasted youth in the Academy of Natural Philosophy, my time with the Eyeless, my years in the Sanctum, and now I finally uncover the secrets of the ancient language. Oh, and I have the key. Okay. Inspect Malchiodi's lodgings. Although this is kind of weird. Oh, shit. One shot! Really? Okay, so I can't kill those things. Just... <laughs> just if I can kill them, I'm not sure how. Okay, so how about this then? Let me see if this is going to work. Alright, we'll see if this works. stone what is that destroyed the envisioned cultist oh is that is there just one or it looks like there was more though okay so technically I can kill it hopefully there's only just the one Oh, yeah, there's another one right there. Can I? Shit. No! Can I salvage? Oh, wait, I get hook mines back, though. Which I guess is fine. I wonder if hook mines work on these things. Oh, son of a bitch. sure I'm running out of Ooh. Pretty sure I'm running out of ammo very quickly. I don't know if the hook mine helped at all or not. I don't think it did. I, s I would assume it it didn't. Uh, 
I got 70 meters away. I wonder if it keeps the same architecture. Right, because there was a way. 24 and 6? I don't know what that is. Yeah, I wonder if... Hmm. At this point, if possible, I would not want to fight these things. I only have one... One thing left. Is that the mark of the outsider? This one was obsessed like all the rest. What did he find out? So, it would be, right, because, okay, so, the way I look at it is this part here, this top part, is nine. The combination to his safe might have something to do with those strange symbols. Yes, and then the middle part is six, so nine, six, and then two. All right, so hopefully I'm correct. I mean, it's not that hard of a puzzle, to be honest. Nine. Oh, I sure. Sure. I am now certain of the meaning of the script adorning the flesh of those who enter the outsider. Who encountered the outsider? It is his name. Ah, the name he lost when he merged with the void. And if this is an, and if this name is returned to him, the old ritual performed by the Envisioned years ago would be undone. The revelation sends shivers down my spine. What I hold is the catalyst that could. Okay, that's definitely not in game. There are. I'm hearing like three different sirens. Stuff is happening, chat. Yeah, there's a fire truck. There's another, there's a, where's that? EMT? Oh, I think I see where they're, nope, never mind. I don't know where they're going. Also not important. Uh, the revelation sends servers down my spine. What I hold is a catalyst that could undo everything our collegiate has accomplished. The ancient language tantalizes me still. Pronunciation was never formed or for any earthly tongue. Perhaps these people long ago spoke with the spirits. But speculation is one of the many pitfalls which threaten the errant philologist. To pursue this further, we necessitate transgressing the deepest con yeah, commandments of our order. No one has earned the. No, no one has entered the ritual hold since the outsider merged with the void. But to find one of those cursed spirits to read his language intrigues and frightens me in equal measure. Against all caution, all prudence, all sense of loyalty. I persist. I cannot abandon my research. This place, this reliquary that holds the outsider's true form, calls to me. My plan, if my plan is to enter the ritual hold, is found out, all is lost. What? The mark is the outsider's name. All he wants is people to say it. This says only spirits in the void can read it. Oh, I killed all of them. The topography of the void is dependent upon reality to supply the base material for it to mirror. However, there is one place that has no referent in our world. Though I know the void sees into our hearts, my fellows call it the ritual hold. Some say it is a cradle, others say a tomb. The outsider himself resides there. To even approach the gate to that place is sacrilege. And even then, the void itself keeps it shut to living eyes. 
truly the ritual hold exists outside of time itself. It would be as futile as it is forbidden to enter. These are thoughts for another time. My research into this ancient alphabet continues. Some remnants of their phonemic qualities are preserved in our oldest writings. The language possesses an unusual amount of diphthongs, reliant on distinction in tone and pitch to convey meaning. Ch the ch these symbols, I know the very nature of the void runs through them, but is it a dead language or the language of the dead? Perhaps that could be the title of my next monograph. All right. So now, how do I? Not what I want to do. I hate this so much. Are you? F what the fuck, game? Like seriously. Do we have... I'm not sure... If we go that way or if we go that way. Okay, well, let's go this way, I guess. Do we... I don't know, is this game going to make me retread my steps? Well, you know what, let's go this way. Oh, fuck my life. Okay. I think we escaped that guy. Oh, who are you? Is a normal dude? Okay, well let's let's go this way. Let's see if oh, I remember this place. Oh, this is not where I want to go. Okay. Yeah, this is just based where I was. Right there, you go. Okay, so never mind that. So we go. Okay, I guess we go back to the beginning of this level. What? No, no, no! You didn't see me. <gasps> There's a lot of everything there. Look over here, please. That was not too bad. Oh, How that's. Long has the outsider been drowning at the heart of the void? Okay, well. Can you not game? No, oh, for Christ's sake. The game cannot.
do they? Oh shit! I get one more person, and I get. You know what? I get one more. I'm running out of stuff. I get one more spring razor. And hopefully there's just one more dude there. Oh, and I can't... Oh, and there's two more. Ah, crap. That's super not what I want to do. But I don't think it matters at this point. I would go there, but I'm pretty sure it's going to say, nah, you're going to fall now. Okay, well, I can't go there, which is extremely annoying. Like, how am I... Oh, am I supposed to go... What? Where the crap am I supposed to go? What? Game! Where do you want me to go? I don't think there's another way down here, is there? Oh, there? Yeah, that's not gonna help. Oh, can I go? Ooh, I can go. Well, look, either I'm gonna, it's gonna work or I'm gonna die, so. Nope! <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna die. <laughs> I I called it. I mean, it worked for a second, but then the game was like, "Look, cartoony." I'm gonna wait for this thing to go away. I'm assuming it's gonna- yeah, okay. Oh shit. Oh come on, game. You don't deserve the touch of the out- Ow! Ow? <laughs> Did you say ow? <laughs> I like you. I'm, I'm sad I had to kill you. There's someone... He, she said, he said, ow. That's amazing. Wait, there's a fourth person, wasn't there? Did I not? Off. Or was the fourth person, did the fourth person end up over here somehow? All right, well, whatever. Oh, yeah! Oh, sh can I...? Yeah, okay, I can do this. And then I think I can do this without falling. Yeah, okay. Oh, fuck. How long has the outsider been drowning at the heart of the void? Oh, fuck my life. I kind of made it. Here. I can feel it. Oh god. Can I? Okay. Honestly, do I have anything? 173. Oh, I can't double jump. Oh, I'm, I can... I'm um, Jesus. I hope it's not a fight. I hope it's just a choice. <laughs> Which is probably going to be a fight, unfortunately. Now everything is gone. The void is stripping it away. What 
look at you. This is what the Abbey tried to hide. Looks like he's in pain. This is what the Eyeless want to know about. I'm at the center of the void itself. And you're not even some kind of horror I need to face down and fight. You're at my mercy. But you've always been at the mercy of bad people, haven't you? You said I had a choice. Well, I'm here to make it. I mean... I've seen what you wanted me to see, you black-eyed bastard. It doesn't change a thing. This is how it ends. This is how it always ends. Are you... Out? I see. I see. There are no choices left. I would assume he'd be happy. I mean, either way, I'm assuming he's happy because it's a release. You've cut away the knot at the center. The rest will fall to pieces. The world will finally change. The world might change. But we won't. Killers never change. Deci no, Deicide? Press the any key. What happened is what had to happen. Maybe it's not fair. But I can't think of much that is. I know the guilty never get what they deserve. I know the black-eyed bastard never did. But with that knife in his heart, I've even the score. He died for the people twisted by his magic. The cults, witches, and killers. For all the madness and chaos they caused. For Dowd, for me. And after all this, I'm still just a murderer. There's so much doubt, but there are some things I know are true. The outsider is no more, and with that, the world will change in ways none of us can know. But the void is still there, echoing just beyond what you can see. And there's no one left to say who will and won't be touched by its magic. Yeah, like a Dishonored 3 would be kind of interesting. It would be very interesting. There's 23... Okay. Is there seriously 27 Bone Charms in this level? Holy cripes. Dedicated the memory of our brilliant composer, Daniel Licht, whose music touched us all. Oh, that's sad. Yo, if if this is the dude that did the music for the first two games, like hat like not hats off to him, but he did incredible work. The music is fantastic. Less so in this game, but the music in the first two games are amazing. I, I actually didn't like the music in this game too much. But it was a little on the um I don't want to say aggressive, it was a little on the intrusive side. Right, the best scores are scores that you don't notice, basically. Whereas this score, I was noticing all the time, and not for the right reasons. It was, it wasn't, the, it wasn't the right mood, and yeah, it wasn't the right mood, and it was like I said, it was just intrusive. Like you knew it was there when it was when it's a, the the type of game this is means that you should like something like Flower, um, or Braid, or you know, have all the music you want. That the score is part of the game. Part of the game. This is not one of those types of games. But yeah, okay. So, uh, floppy. That's kind of weird. So, is it gonna, or do I care to wait? I'm assuming I can see the credits whenever I want. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna watch the credits whenever I want. Later. I did not like this game as much as the other two. It's it's it definitely lacks a little bit of polish, right? There's a lot of times where e either I wouldn't catch like okay, first of all, I didn't like the blink ability because you had to click twice, right? Once to kind of 
anchor where you want to go and then a second time to actually go there which is it's, I don't like that idea I didn't like that people could see you when it made no sense like the dog wasn't even looking at me at one point when I was near the bank and the dog saw me uh, just you know like an hour and a bit ago I was on top of the on top of the the above the hallway and someone saw me when I don't think they should have been able to but it was a dishonored game it's, it's a nice it's nice it's it's it was a nice on the story side it's very good it was a little bit weird to place I don't like that they chose to make Dowd live which is a little annoying especially because you have like because then killing him in the first game is not canon anymore which like why would you do that a little bit funny unless which if I maybe I didn't catch it but unless the outsider came in after he died stepped in and then resurrected him but that's kind of like why would you do that that is kind of bizarre but yeah so yeah, I'll do my best to keep this brief. Uh, I figured I should probably say a few things about the game. Because uh, I did criticize the game while I was playing. And uh, I think I did say good things about it when I was playing. Um, so this is just a way to kind of aggregate all my thoughts to make it a bit more concise. Because I usually say that after I finish the game, but I didn't really say anything um, when I was streaming. But anyway... So, I've said before in the previous games that I don't really have that much of an issue with Dishonored 1 and 2. I find they're the perfect blend of stealth and non-stealth. So, if you want to go in <coughs> guns blazing, you can do that. If you want to go in non-lethal, you can do that in any way you want. Um, so, one thing I didn't like about this game, however, it seems to punish you a couple times for doing... Uh, one thing or the other when the game doesn't want you to do that, which I find kind of antithetical to what the other Dishonored games uh, were doing. So uh, f in, in level two uh, or mission two, um, when you go into the Spectre Club, you can go in and I ended up killing everybody because, you know, I was playing High Chaos. And in uh, mission three, when I went back, the club was closed. As it should be, because there was math, you know, mass murder. However, if you go in non-lethal, you can actually go back into the club in mission three and go through the Spectre Club again and get more items and get more coins. And uh, I've said a few times that the game is pretty stingy with its coins, so I just don't like the idea that um, this is kind of punishing you for for being lethal, right? Uh, this is kind of telling you, you played it wrong because you're missing stuff now. Uh, whereas the, the first two games never had that, and, and neither the DLCs for the first game didn't have that either. Uh, there was not really any oh, overly obvious pros or cons um, outside the, the, the cynical ending. <laughs> right? Over, High Chaos gives you more rats. Um, it gives you more blood flies, but other than, you know, low chaos makes it cleaner. But other than that, it didn't really change much. Whereas this is very much a you did bad type of situation um, where you are missing stuff because you decided to, to go lethal. So I didn't really like that. Um, in, in the bank job contract, you also can't kill anybody, right? It punishes you again for, for being lethal. Uh, you and, and because the game is so stingy with 900 coins is a lot in this game and and so because it's so stingy with your coins you kind of can't kill anybody um, st stupidly enough you can't even uh, render someone unconscious right you can't you can't take them and, and and choke them out because that's injuring them apparently so I that that's kind of silly then and, and that sort of logic is something I didn't really enjoy but um, but yeah, so, so, so that's something that the game did that I'm not a big fan of. Um, it's it's not... Right? This is one of those games where you can play however you want to play. And in the end screen, 
right? There's the four corners. <laughs> you can be stealthy and legal, lethal. You can be uh, non-stealthy and non-lethal. You, you, know, you can be a whole bunch of different things. Whereas this game is like, no, these specific parts you have to do this, or else you don't, um, you 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 can't. Or uh, yeah, I guess you get punished for it, or else you miss stuff, or else you, um, yeah, you miss out on, um, on 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 these things. It also, like, this is something that that I I noticed more when I was playing. And it might be just my memory of the first two games being a bit more rosy than they should be. But one thing I didn't like, and I'm pretty sure I pointed it out a few times, <laughs> whereas it funnels you into certain areas, like in one way into certain areas. Um, so uh, the the right if it wants if it doesn't it doesn't allow you to go multiple ways into certain areas. Um, so just as an example, in in Dishonored One. You can go into Lady's, Lady Boyle's party in a couple different ways. Um, if you want to sneak in, you can sneak in. If you want to go through a front door, you can do that. In um, D2, D2 and Dishonored 2, uh, it, it does... Okay, so one of the weakest parts of the game is in the Dust District, because there's only one way to get into the Dust District, uh, through the Wall of Light. Future Pat here uh, to mention that there are actually two ways into the Dust District. There's through the Wall of Light, that I mentioned. Uh, the second way is through a window. On the right side of that area, there is some wooden supports on a building. You can actually climb through those supports to get into um, an apartment that leads on the other side of the wall of light. I'd known about that apartment, but for some reason, I never connected jumping out the window to the other side of the, the wall of light, or um, I just forgot about it. And that's the very last section of the game. Uh, even getting into the throne, there's two ways into the throne room. The very last, essentially the last room in the game, there's two ways of getting into that room. Future pad again. Uh, there's actually three ways into the throne room. Uh, one is uh, through the front door from the outside. Um, the second one is on the left side. You can crawl through the, some broken wall pieces. Uh, the third one is in the castle itself. Uh, you can interact with a candle holder on a wall that gets you to a small secret passage, a small room uh, through a fireplace. Uh, you get an audiograph in there, you get a couple things you can pick up. Uh, but there's also there's also a door that leads you to the safe room from the tutorial area. Uh, so from that, it's not that hard to leave that area and get to the throne room. Um, so I need a correction on that as well. Um, I also chose to, I'll, I'll mention this now, I, spo I specifically chose to not mention this in my thoughts video, but in in Death of the Outsider, on the, in the courtyard in front of the bank, uh, there's still basically one way to get in. It's it's through the gate. You can go up to the, the stairs, uh, but then you're gonna have to deal with some uh, guards in one way or another, or, or another. Or you can go o over the gate like I did a couple different times. Um, but there's no way to sneak in from below or from above or through an apartment. So uh, for whatever reason, either. Uh, they they didn't have enough time, or they decided they couldn't, or just or didn't add uh, extra flexibility um, to the game uh, for whatever reason. Um, but yeah, so the, the, these two these two corrections I had to make uh, just go to show that uh, there's even more flexibility uh, in that than I thought there was. Whereas in Death of the Outsider, that flexibility isn't there. Um, so yeah, so this just reinforces my point I was trying to make. Um, in any case, uh, back to Younger Pat. Whereas, contrast that with this game, there's one way of getting into Jacoby's speech area. There's, and, and even, you can, you can, and, and one way into, uh, which is the same area, one way to get to the, the auction. Even if you decide to leave different, like, because you can leave a couple different ways, Right when you go back, you can only go in the one way. Right, you can go into the stairs, and that's it. You can't go in through the building or do anything else. So it finally, so there's one way to get into that, and that's kind of annoying. Um, the what else? Oh, in the bank mission, again in the bank mission, there is one way to get to the low to the um, the lower atrium. Right, there's this one way to get into the low, lower atrium uh, through those doors, and not only that, there's only one way to get to those doors. You have to go uh, into that little hallway, 
disable the pylons and then you can get to that door. So not only is there one way to get to the next area, there's only one way to get to the door that leads to the next area. So again, it, it's very restrictive. Now before like, you know, before that and after that, you have a little bit of freedom, but it's, it's just um, lack of variety, right? Lack of options, which is not something the games are, are generally known for, <laughs> which is kind of annoying. Um, so uh, another thing, um, an another thing that I, this is partly my fault, and I also partly put the blame on um, on Arcane for that, is that th I skip the tutorials. And that's, I, that's kind of, I don't, I don't usually skip the tutorials. So uh, the first time I play a game, I usually go to the tutorial level, do everything, so I know how to play the game, and then I'll go play the game. Um, but in, in the first two Dishonored games, the tutorials are at the very beginning. There's like a little part in front of the game, and then you can play the tutorial, and then you play through the rest of the game. Whereas this one, the tutorial is interspersed, like small videos, interspersed through the rest of the game. Um, I don't like that part of it because it stops the action, right? When you're, <laughs> one thing I don't like is that if the game stops you from playing the game, then why would I want to play the game, right? And so because of that, because I skip tutorials, um, again, because I just wanted to play the game, uh, because I skip tutorials, I missed a few very important things, right? Um, foresight allows you to go through the little rat, not the rat, but the air ducts, right? At one point I was looking at an air duct and I was trying to figure out how to get through it, but it's foresight. Um, a tutorial, and, and then, you know, once you're on the other side of the air duct, um, you can actually uh, cast your displacement, your displace and and sort of zoom over on the other side if you can see your, your displacement. Uh, so, uh, another thing is, yeah, so yeah, so when you force it, yeah, so you can cast displacement. So those types of things, th those two things, oh, and if you're, if you, if you put your displacement somewhere, it stays there. Uh, and, you know, so you can move around, and that's still, still going to stay there, so you can go do something else and then zoom back up there. Um, so those th things are in tutorials, and they're, they're short videos, but put them at the front of the game, right? Um, I'm sure a lot of people skipped the game. But I don't know what the, the scores are, the Metacritic scores are for this game. But I'm sure a lot of people skipped the tutorials because, again, in the middle of the game, you want to play the game. So I didn't like that. Um, so, yeah, so, so these, these, the unclear powers, you, you saw me. There's a lot of things I could have done that I didn't do, and I struggle a little bit sometimes because um, I didn't use the powers in the way they were supposed to be used. And I kind of, again, I, that's on me because I didn't watch the tutorials. Uh, but I'm also looking in Arcane's direction as well for not being as, uh, not being, well, not necessarily being consistent, but being a bit, uh, I don't want to say lazier, um, but being, so, okay, so, the, the, everything I've said, right, the, you, you repeat, so you, you go to the same level twice, you do that in the first Dishonored, but you end up going to different areas in that level, right, um, you go to... Uh, right when you go to Dunwall in 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 the first level in the first game sorry um, right you go see Granny Rags and you go to the, um, the, the the Hatters and you go do a couple other things um, you go back later but you end up doing different things right going to different spots in that level whereas in this game you go to the streets and you have to go to the same buildings you have to do the same things, right? I did point out that going into the bank in Mission 2 and then not being able to do anything is a missed opportunity. But then, you know, you go to Mission 3 and then you actually go in the bank. That, to me, is... In, so I, I don't like that part of it because there's nothing new in Mission 3 that was there in Mission 2 other than the mission you're supposed to do, the, the bank part of it. And that that's not something I'm, I'm, I'm a big fan of. Um, see, to me, that indicates, and I have no, I, I haven't, I haven't read up on this game at all, but that indicates, like, that, to me, that gives me serious Borderlands pre-sequel vibes, where the game, this was designed as a DLC, and then it got big, and they decided to just release it as a full game, and it seems like, and, and all these things show me cut corners, uh, 
right? The the tutorials, the way they're implemented, because it's it's harder to make a small tutorial in the same way, um, in the way that you have in in, in Dishonored Two, than you do in here. Uh, the way they did this in this game is very easy. It's very it doesn't require as many resources and it's faster to make. So this is very, yeah, like I said, very, very strong pre-sequel vibes. And that kind of shows through in the quality of the game. Um, I did say it was buggy and that kind of thing, but I'm not going to focus on that. Because uh, these are the, the, the bigger things. Um, however, I, I enjoyed the game. <laughs> it's Dishonored. It's more Dishonored. I These things are kind of annoying. Um, especially in a first playthrough. Because especially not knowing how to use the powers properly, and myself not, you know, and it's like, again, it's kind of on me for not experimenting, or at least not trying to, to look around or do different things with them. Uh, right, it's, it's a, uh, now, having said that, the silver lining is that I end up finishing the game with limitations that I should not have had. So, you know what? I'm a perfect player. That's I'm, I'm right. That's that's, <laughs> that's that's what I get out of this. But, um, yeah, so the, the semblance and foresight and displacement I don't like the implementation of it uh, where you press a button and then you press a button the second time to 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 displace yourself I don't like that idea what, what's the problem with just holding the button down until you need to zoom out until you need to blink or until you need to displace yourself uh, that's but that's a small minor point uh, the, the the idea of it is nice the idea of semblance is nice even though I didn't use it too much um, the uses are again are on me um, there's a lot of powers that I don't end up using in these games, and right, maybe I'll do a challenge run later where I can only use that. Um, so, but it's nice to have. I like the idea of a foresight. That was very useful, right? I used it. Uh, the more I played it, the more I used it, which is very nice. Um, I like the idea of the contracts uh, instead of um, in, instead of you know, in, for example, going and talking to Mindy, who you know lived a very long and very happy life in my playthrough. Instead of going to talking to NPCs, you go to the black market. And it makes sense there would be contracts there for black for the middle for, for, for black marketeers. Um, the implementation again could have been a bit better. Right? I don't like that you have to kill some and you have to save some. Uh, that's again the lack of choice. And I know I don't have to kill people or I don't have to save them. But again the game is very stingy in it's uh, and it's and it's resources uh, and it's currencies. So you kind of have to do what you want in order to buy as many things as you can. But overall, I liked it. Uh, I will definitely enjoy it more the second time I play. I played a high chaos. I'm gonna try to play low chaos next time I play it. Um, so those are my final thoughts about the game. That's what I think. Now, I hope you enjoyed the video, and um, I hope uh, to see you soon.